The Gulf of Mexico could have a dead zone almost 8,000 square miles in size due to this year's record-breaking rainfall in the American Midwest. Citing scientists' predictions, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA, says the dead zone could be one of the largest on record. The NOAA explains on its website that dead zones, also referred to as hypoxic zones, have low oxygen levels that are deadly to marine life. These occur as nutrients present in fertilizers such as nitrogen and phosphorus are washed into rivers due to annual rainfall. Nutrients present in the river water runoff then cause algae to grow in ocean water as fresh water doesn't mix with the oceans due to its density. Nancy Rabelais, an ocean ecologist at Louisiana State University, told National Geographic that animals such as shrimp and fish will swim away from hypoxic zones when oxygen levels drop below two parts per million.